On Saturday, June 18th, my niece Nikki and I flew from Athens to the Greek island of Milos. In 2021, Travel and Leisure magazine ranked Milos as the number one island in the world. So when we planned our trip, we made this a must-stop destination. When we landed, we picked up our rental car and then drove to our Airbnb to drop off our luggage. We stopped by the grocery store to pick up some snacks and then made our way to one of the most famous places on the island, Siracaniko Beach. Siracaniko is on the north side of the island. Over time, waves driven by the north winds have shaped this grayish white volcanic rock into amazing shapes and the area is often compared to a moonscape.
There are stray cats everywhere in Milos. This one wanted to hang out with us so he could try to sneak into my backpack and get some food. Of course, it didn't work. We walk to the other side of Saracanico that's been made famous for its rock jumping. On the day we were there, the winds were very strong, making the waves extremely large. However, there were still a few brave people that couldn't pass up the opportunity to rock jump at this famous location. We met some really nice people from Connecticut and Austria who were all rock jumping and trying to talk Nikki into doing it. Nikki finally got up the nerve to jump in herself. The jump itself wasn't bad, but fighting the waves to swim back over to the rock to climb the rope out was much more difficult. We said goodbye to our friends that we met from Connecticut and Austria and then started walking back to the car. Because it was so windy, we decided to leave and drive to the south side of the island in hopes of finding a beach that was much more calm. As we were driving south, I pulled the car over to admire the beauty of the harbor with the damas in the background. When we reached the south side of the island, we stopped at an overlook over Sigrada Beach, but we kept moving on until we reached the parking area for Fira Plaka Beach. We parked the car and walked a few hundred feet to Fira Plaka Beach. This is great. Feels fantastic. Oh my gosh. This might be the best beach I've ever been to. <laughs> Indeed, it was much less windy, making the water much more calm and enjoyable. What a great decision to move to the south side of the island.
We loved Fira Plaka Beach, but now it was time to go back to the apartment to shower and get ready for dinner. Before going to Adamas for dinner, we stop by the beautiful fishing village of Klima. Back in Adamas, we had an outstanding dinner at Flisvos. What an amazing first day in Milos, but tomorrow would turn out to be even better. <laughs> <laughs> 